two more two more days. Hello, class. To have some break. Hello, teacher. Hello, Hello teacher. teacher. What do you mean two more days? Yeah, Friday and, and Saturday. Wow. We, we, we have to work half of the day on Saturday. Oh, yeah. And then you take a break. Or oh, some, yeah, or some guys, uh, lucky guys, or, or yeah, they, they just left one day. Right? Yeah, I, I, I don't work Saturday and Sunday, so I'm, I'm uh -huh. lucky. Look, lucky you. Oh, yes. <laughs> Good for you, teacher. I don't work from Saturday mm -hmm. and Sunday, and I work from 8 to 4. Wow. Nuri, Nuri work in the weekend, right, Nuri? Yes. <laughs> yes. Right. Oh. Yeah. A lot of lucky guys. But it's difficult because when, when um because I don't work is when I work the most because my wife works. <clears throat> so that yeah. on the weekends I take care of my son all day. That's fun. But um, I have to go to the supermarket. I have to do this. I have to do that, and then you have to do the dishes. Yeah, that's fine. fine. I wash my clothes. You just you put it in a wash machine. Yes. Uh, and the dryer. <laughs> the dryer. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah. Oh God, I'm I'm going to turn on the fan because it's very very. Hot here. Yeah, today was hot, man. Right? Yes, it's hot. What time you wake up your son in the weekend, teacher? Is like it in the weekend or in the weekend? On the on, weekend. On the weekend, okay. On the like weekend. at like at seven in the morning. Mm. Early. <laughs> <laughs> But the thing is, because on Saturdays, I am alone with my son all day. I let him do whatever he wants. Like if he only wants to be in his underwear and running all over the house, ah, do it. If he wants to play with rocks, mud, ah, do it. I just watch TV. I just watch him from a distance. <laughs> like, okay, he's okay. But you clean the house when your wife come? Yes, yes, of course. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> All, All right. right. <laughs> yeah, I, the thing is, like, I, before I got married, I lived alone, like, for 10 years. So I got used to doing my own things. I cook, I wash my own clothes, I, I do that. Congrats. Yeah, so that's cool. <clears throat> so how is everybody? Yeah, no. Good. Good picture. That's your they son, look, Alex. He looks tired. Uh yeah. He he wants to watch everybody here. What is I his name? Know. It's Alex Jr. <laughs> okay, Alex Jr. Cool. Alexito is ahí. Oh nice. I, I don't know why, why he wants to stay here, but he's calm <clears throat> like like um, no uh, the other the other days was you know playing. It, how many playing. children do you have? One. This one. my this my only one. <laughs> yeah. Are you do you plan to have more? No, no. Yeah. You know, I've noticed that about our generation that we are <clears throat> only staying with one. One son, two, maybe. Mm -hmm. Because the previous generation, well, I mean, I've noticed that my generation, you know, we, we only have one, two the most. The previous generation, whatever, you know, like three, four children. And now the new generation like Mirna, they don't want to have children. <laughs> right. They want to have cats. Or, or only... Or only um, <laughs> one or two. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I have five sisters and, and five brothers. It's a big family. Right. Oh so, my gosh. So your mother <laughs> had a younger than 
I am, yeah, I am the younger than brothers and sisters. The little Wait, you, the baby. Your mother had 11 children. No, nine with me, 10. Oh, you know, I, okay, I, 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 I mean, Chloe, so I'm thinking, so I'm oh, okay. So yeah. you then you say we are five girls and five boys. Yeah, si, si, si. You know, I oh, have a lot God. of siblings also. <laughs> I think because that's why I only had, to one, only had to, to have one. Because my siblings, we are a lot also. I, I still win. <laughs> I still with you, you know? <laughs> Yeah, I, because, I yeah. would like to have more children, but I can't. I mean, I don't want to because I don't think it's fair. <clears throat> the economy is too bad, and if I want, yeah, if, if if I want to give my son the best, right? Uh, you know, if I have more children, then I reduce the possibilities for my son. So, not that's, just one, and he's that's terrible. The thing. So. <laughs> you true. see the the situation mm -hmm. everywhere, and and. Yeah, any do you know any, um, I was reading I was reading that um in Time magazine the big business about adopting. Mm -hmm. And um what happened is that uh wait Holland Holland for example I have a friend he lives in Bulgaria and he tells me if you have a son in Bulgaria it's like you have doors open for anything. Yeah. Because people don't want to have children. Um, one of my my wife's, one of her cousins, he went to live to Germany working. Mm -hmm. what he, he went to work to Germany and he took his wife. So they had one child here and they had one in Germany. So mm -hmm. after that, his wife in Germany, she wanted to be sterilized. And the hospital said, no. Nope. And she oh. says, well, what? No, I, I don't want no more children. It's like, they want you to have more children. Right. Yeah. But do, do you know what the problem is? <laughs> I was reading that um, the problem is that those countries are so open mind that kids, they start having sexual relations at a very young age, like at 13 or 14. The only difference is that they use protection, like they take pills or they take their, you know, vaccines, their, mm -hmm. their shots. <clears throat> the problem is, imagine if you're a girl and you're 13 and you've been using pills and now you're 35 or 40 and you say, no, I'm ready yeah. to have a child. You can't anymore. Your, your body is, you're sterilized. And, yes, and, and that's what's happening to a lot of women, because according to the study you, in Europe, everybody wants to be, start becoming parents after 35, between 35 and 40. <clears throat> and when it's time to decide, okay, let's do it, they can't. They realize like, oh my God, I can't have children anymore. And then they start spending a lot of money and, and treatments. So the last resort is adoption. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's why adoption is a very good business because that's why, <clears throat> and that's why that's where the trafficking of children came. You mm -hmm. know, they started trafficking children because obviously, imagine if you're from Finland, you are extremely white and blue, mm -hmm. blue eyes. You want a son. Moreno, maybe brown eyes. It was that totally different. So, Latin America, good business. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's bad. <clears throat> so, that, that's, that, that's. But that's, the adoption is very expensive. It is very, it's a good business. Mm -hmm. Very, very expensive. I hear that adoption in El Salvador is difficult too, right? It's difficult yes. to adopt. It's difficult, and the uh, you need to pay uh, about um, ten thousand dollar and fifteen dollar. This is the price. For uh, you need to uh, do tests 
about psycholo psycholo psychology, 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 and economics. Oh man, that's that's too bad. Well, wow. oh well. So uh, look at Larry in his hammock. Oh yeah. <clears throat> You look, you look very chill. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, what a life, right? <clears throat> yeah. Are you, what part of the house are you in? In your room? Uh, no, no, it's uh, something like, uh, I don't know. It's uh, a lot of things around me. It's like that room that where you put everything. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let me show you something. <clears throat> it, it looks big. Yeah, yeah. It's more about uh, three by three. All right, cool. All right, class. So yesterday, remember, we did a reading about adopting. <clears throat> Remember that that woman that had thirty children, I think. Yeah. Yes, thirty. Thirty children in one house. Oh my god! <laughs> All she's right. Making business. Yeah, she's doing. She's doing good. Good business. <laughs> Has anybody seen Batman yet? Nope. Nope. No. But it comes out today, right? I guess so. Yeah, but I keep on checking Cuevana and nothing yet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you know Cuevana class? Yeah, I know it. Yeah. No. You don't know Cuevana? Me da risa la cara de perdido de todos. Yeah. Cuevana is where you watch all the movies. Uh, que las ves en el teléfono y las puedes poner a la tele, right? Yeah. Uh, sí, mis hijos lo ven. <laughs> yeah. So I've been watching today like Cuevana because I want to watch Batman. <laughs> the last time I made a line for a movie, <clears throat> and this is embarrassing, it was for Twilight. Remember that movie Twilight? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. I went to the movies to watch that with my girlfriend, my wife. She was my girlfriend, but I wanted to watch it, not her. And yeah. <laughs> yeah, but wait, the only reason I remember I had I had a class on a Saturdays and it was teenagers and it was only girls. And I'm oh my god, it's so difficult because they they you know like non siendo el aire acondicionado. Why? Because every time you turn that on, you kill a whale. <laughs> really? <laughs> so it was very difficult to teach teenage girls. So I remember my boss told me once: Look, people talk about two things only. Things they like or things they understand. So I said, okay, so tell me, because all of them had the book of Twilight. So I asked them, okay, so tell me, what is the story about Twilight? And they started telling me like, oh my God, and then Edward and Jacob and this and that. So I actually became interested. <laughs> And I went to watch the movie. It was very embarrassing. That that's maybe one of the most embarrassing moments of my life. Oh, really? But do you like that? The movie? No. No. <laughs> oh, another one is when the Lucha Libre, the WWF, the well, WWE, when they came. Remember when they came? Nope. I didn't see that. Wait, first of all, do you know WWE, the wrestling? 
Yes. 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 The, the old version, the old one. No, they came, I think, in the year 2004, 2000. They came two times. I, I went. The frozen me. <laughs> you, you what? I saw the, the program, WWF. Did you go to uh, El Ignacio when they came? No, I saw in the TV. Oh, <laughs> I went and it was funny because do you know Rey Mysterio? So he took off his shirt and he threw it. Oh yeah. And I caught it. I have oh. it. <laughs> I, I still have it. I will show you tomorrow. But the funny part was that I caught it and the, the part in the bottom, there was a little kid next to me and me la quería jalar, you know, like, <laughs> and I said, mm, you know, hell, I was happy with the shirt. That little kid was crying all night. Oh. Yes, I felt bad, but oh, come on, man. It was very mysterious shirt. <laughs> La mamá bien brava, es muy good, like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so uh, that was another one. All right, do you see my screen? So we did yes. that part yeah. yesterday. Let's do the next. Yeah. <clears throat> Let okay, me see. Go ahead. All right, so we're in lesson two now. Lesson objective. So by this, by the end of this session, participants will be able to practice past modals, phrasal modals of obligation. I know that maybe Jenny, Mirna, you remember, uh, and Sonia, you remember past modals, correct? And Nuri too. Yes, yeah. teacher. Okay, so don't say anything because you will explain to the people that don't understand past modals. Well, Do you know? I, I don't remember, teacher, I don't. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, Jenny remembers. Maybe, maybe, Sonia, Nuri, do you remember? Mm. A little bit. <laughs> a little a bit. Little. <laughs> All right. So, what is a past modal, uh, Luis? Maybe uh, when you use uh, should with plus a past participle. Should, okay. should. Well, should is a modal. I choose a moral, but yeah, I don't know. I, I, I am not sure it's, it's necessary to use a past participle. Okay. To, uh, do you think have... do you think can can has a past? Yes. Yes. What uh -huh. what is the past of can? Luis. Yeah. Cool. It's cool. 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 Yeah. yeah, it's cool. Mm -hmm. So uh -huh. okay, so that. Okay, remember, can is something I can do now. Could is something I could do in the past, and now I can't. Yes. All right, so more or less, that's what we're going to study today. So just to get an idea. So let me see. Nobody went to church yesterday to get your... Hey, cross. Christian cross. cross. No. 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 The, the USA Today says that the cross is a smudge. It's a what? A smudge. Smudge. Yeah, una marca, un, un símbolo sin, sin gracia. But what is smudge? Uh, marca. Uh, tipo cicatriz or algo así. Where did you like see that? Yeah, uh, hey, uh, USA Today. The, no, okay, the, good, good. So USA Today said that the cross is a mush. Yeah, smash. M smash. I never heard that. Smash. smash. Okay. It's smooth hair. Oh, it's smudge. It's much. Yes, it's a smudge. Oh, okay. It's not as much for us. It's yeah. across. No, I've noticed that not, I mean, the churches were empty yesterday. Well, many churches were empty. I've yeah, noticed that the, the tradition. Traffic. Yeah. And maybe too that the tradition is going down. Yeah, a little bit. 
Mm -hmm. My son came with a cross. Oh, really? Yeah. But immediately I erased it. <laughs> Why? <laughs> huh? Well, you know, his mother wasn't here. Like, come here, come here. No, take that off, take that off. <laughs> because, you know, he would tell you, I, I don't know, there are many reasons, but I don't know. But he, he goes to a Christian kindergarten, so he has to. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So let's listen to the um, to the lady here. Hey, she looks good in black. I think she looks nice in black. What do you think? I pass. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> no, I'm not saying if you like her. I'm saying she looks <laughs> nice. Because, uh, he maybe is looking at his teeth. Or, no, way. Or his teeth. <laughs> no way. No, no way. No way. Her teeth. <laughs> No, I, I you people are, are rude. No, I'm saying black yeah. looks good on her. Yeah, maybe. You know, like you you that's a that's a very good compliment. You can tell sometimes that to people, you know. Yeah. You, you people are bad. You know, you can tell, hey, you know, red looks good on you, white looks good on you, black looks good on you. All right, so let's listen to her. Hi, we're about to study past mode. Can you hear? Yes. 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 All right. And phrase the models of obligation. Stay and watch the explanation. Past models and phrasal models of obligation. Should have, was supposed to, had to, and needed to all describe obligations in the past, although they sometimes have different uses. I should have stayed home and studied. It was a good idea, but I didn't do it. I was supposed to be studying this weekend. It was required, but I didn't do it. I had to wear a uniform. We were forced to do this. I didn't have to go with my friends, but I did. There was no obligation. I thought I needed to have more clothes. I thought this was necessary. Past models and phrasal models. Should have is followed by a past participle, whereas was, were, supposed to, had to, didn't have to, I needed to, are followed by the simple form of the verb. Had to describes strong obligation in the past and suggests there was no choice. I had to water my plants was, were, not supposed to, suggest an expectation that the action was required or prohibited. It is comparable in meaning to wasn't, weren't allowed to. He was supposed to graduate last year. Should have suggest that the action was advisable, but was not done. Should not have suggest that the action was not advisable but was done. He should have learned English before. Needed, did they need to, suggest that an action was necessary, but there was choice about doing it or not. She needed to exercise. Didn't have to means that there was not obligation to do the action. They didn't have to wake up early. Complete the following sentence. Did. There was no obligation. I'm sorry, I passed. <laughs> that was funny. Okay, so let's do should have, was supposed to, had to, needed to all describe obligations in the past. I so. thought clothes. Models and phrasal models. Hold on. Should have is followed by a past participle. Okay, should have is followed by a past participle, correct? So what is should have? Whereas was. When do we use should? Suggestion. For a suggestion. Okay, but, you know, 
It's past. It's it's done. So there's nothing you can do anymore. Like for example, that man from Sarita. You know. Yeah. If I see him, hey, you should have ignored the man. You should have just think, but it's bien fácil decir esos comentarios cuando todo esté hecho. In the moment, yeah. it's different. You know, in the moment. Yeah. Your, blood, your blood is boiling. Yes, of course. You know. Um, so let's do let's do one thing here. Nuri, hi. Are you there? Yes, teacher. How are you? Fine. Thank you. All right. Nuri, I I want you to give me an advice in the past, okay? You know, I bought my wife flowers in the morning. And in the afternoon, when I gave her the flowers, they were dead. Okay. You should put the flowers on. You should have put. You should have put the flowers uh, with water. On water. On in water. water. Actually, in water. <laughs> All right. Very good. You see, you understand class? You should have put the water. No, I'm sorry. You should have put the flowers in water. Yeah. It could be a negative advice. For example, you mm -hmm. you should yeah. you shouldn't bother you shouldn't bother too early. You shouldn't that, have that day. Okay, oh, you, you shouldn't, shouldn't have bought it. You shouldn't have bought it too early, yeah. Okay, that day. Good. Or you should have bought artificial flowers. <laughs> yeah, everybody. It's, it's not correct. It's not correct. <laughs> I mean, for for your wife, you know. We're married. Not... Yeah. A crochet flower. Yeah, but... <laughs> it's, it's not... We're married. You know, be happy I bought you flowers. Yeah. <laughs> or I should have gone to the cemetery and get flowers <laughs> from a tomb. <laughs> Clean them and give them to my wife. Uh, yeah. yeah, the purple one. The purple ones. <laughs> so, uh, Mirna. So, like I told you, I went to the event, and then Ray Mysterio took off his shirt. He threw it, and I caught it. And then the little boy next to me, he was pulling on the shirt, and I pulled it. And the little kid was crying all night. <laughs> Do you think I did the correct thing? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. No. Wow. What a hurt. You catch that that's the shirt. Okay. Actually, I did catch it first. Yeah. <laughs> the first week. <laughs> no, but um you should have uh have gave even have given the shirt to the children to the child to the child sorry no yeah, or, or you should have a <laughs> how are you how are you gonna say share share you should have shared half and shared. a half <laughs> half a half right you're crazy <laughs> you mean to no. Take a crap cup. <laughs> it's a poor I, boy. You should, hey. You should, you should give a. That little him. boy should have been quicker. <laughs> I, I actually, I taught that little kid a lesson. You see, kid, you always have to be quicker. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> you, sh you shouldn't have fought with the kid. <laughs> No, because you know what's funny? Because when I caught it, when I caught it, I see him like pulling it. Yo, chieste. 
Mono Mayunco. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> little kid. Oh my and, God. But the bad part is, I heard his mother all night. I just, yeah, you know, I was like, ooh, I, I ignored her. And I went alone. The next day, I went to the hotel to get the autographs. Uh-huh. And that was funny because there was a big line. No, not a big line, but maybe 40 people. The 40 were children. I was the only adult. <laughs> and I go with a pillow. When the Hulk Hogan was at, and the shirt of Rey Mysterio. <gasps> and all the little kids were looking at me. And I say, oh, I, I, I want an autograph for my son. Oh, my son. Yeah, I didn't have a son. <laughs> it was for me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, all right. Larry. Uh, I saw my ex-girlfriend yesterday. Man, she looked very, very beautiful. And um, she told me to give her my telephone number and she will call me. But I didn't give her my telephone number. Did I do the correct thing? Yes, you didn't have gave your number. You shouldn't have given her. Yeah. You Repeat. shouldn't have given her. The phone number. Oh, okay. Sure. You shouldn't yeah. have given her your phone yeah. number. Okay, good. Good. Class, that was an example, okay? Don't don't <laughs> don't do that. Please. Don't tell to your, yes, don't don't tell to your that. wife. <laughs> it's for no. real. <laughs> no, no, it was an example. <laughs> but you see there, there's conversations from examples. Yes, recorded. <laughs> Sonia, hi. Hi, teacher. You know, I had an opportunity, like, I had an opportunity to buy the Bad Bunny tickets. And this is true. I did have an opportunity because I have a friend that works in Todo Ticket. She, well, her father, her father is the owner of Todo Ticket. And she told me, do you want tickets? Do you want to buy tickets? And I said, no, please, you're crazy. I don't want to buy tickets. But then I see that people are paying double or triple for the tickets. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, I should have bought the tickets. You think? Yes, you should have bought the tickets. Yeah. Yeah, yeah now should. when I see it, yeah, I should have bought the tickets. To sell it? So, of course, yes. to sell it. My friend, so, my friend, my friend so, bought six tickets me in Platea of, of uh, $75. And he, I don't know, sell it? Sold it. Mm -hmm. uh, he sold them? $200. For $200? Yeah. Each ticket. Oh my God. Yeah. So you lost the business feature. <laughs> yes. Don't tell good, me, man. It hurts. Good business. But I think that people, it's crazy. I don't know. I don't pay that for, for a ticket. The only group I would do that for is for you two only. I would be in line for one month to watch you two, but only that's it. You two are the Rolling Stones. But imagine Bad Bunny, oh man. But you know what? I imagine that Carol, Carol G, Carol J, 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 whatever her name is. Carol G. Okay, her, her. Se le va a llenar. Yeah. Because people said, oh, man, we we didn't go to Bad Bunny. Let's go see Carol G. And came Daddy Yankee, too. 
and Mark Anthony and Alejandro Sanz. They're coming? Yeah, and Danny Ocean. I don't know if you know. Who the hell is Danny Ocean? <laughs> I think. Who is he? He's someone like my cousin. Only his mother knows me. <laughs> Only his mother knows him. Yeah, no. Have you been to concerts? No. Yes. Yes. Which concert did you go to? I went in to to El Bukis. Marco Antonio. Oh. You know, I would like to see a bookie. I think he's good. Yes. I saw I saw Juan Gabriel in concert. That was a good concert. Mm -hmm. I saw him two times. But no, he did in El Salvador. One in San Francisco in the United States and one in El Salvador. The, la the, the last time he came, I went with my mother. Many, many years ago. Yes. Okay. I went with my mother. It was an excellent concert. Yes, I have so. I have seen her hits concerts. Is they are nice. Yeah. Um. The the last concert I went to was Aerosmith. In El Salvador, man, that was a good concert. Concert. That was a very good concert. All right. So we understand should have right. Should have. Yes. 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 Right. Should have is followed by a past participle. Like, um, I'm sorry, pero pobrecito Neto Mason, he should have left the country. You know, like everybody, like all the politicians, they left. Well, poor man, he's suffering now, but he should have left. Is I think. Uh, Simple. Whereas was. I'm sorry, Larry. Do you have the fan or something on? No, nothing. Because when you turn on your microphone, you. I don't know, class. Do you hear static? Yes. 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 Like yeah. a oh, really? It's it's, a noise. Yeah, it, it sounds like a fan or. It sounds like this. <laughs> Excuse me, maybe my microphone is too too close to me. I don't know. Oh, it sounds mm -hmm. like a AM radio. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, something. Yes. Yeah, yeah. It sounds like. That's why you're so not... shooting me. Shooting me. <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's why. Not... <laughs> Excuse me. I will. No, no. I will shut myself. No. No. That's okay. Suena, suena como una narración de un partido de tercera en AM. <laughs> no, but it's okay. Yeah. So when when uh, when I ask you, it's no problem. All right. So let's see the next one. Where I was and were supposed to. I was supposed to. That means you had to do something, but you didn't. Yes. Have you ever forgotten to pick up your child in the in the school? No. Really? Never. No. Oops. I have. Just you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Just me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> eh, but you know, it happens. <laughs> no, because um. I have a problem that sometimes I don't listen to my wife. I mean, I do, I, she, she, because she tells me too many things in the morning and, and I, and I, you know, like, okay, I'm driving by, uh huh, okay. And maybe I want to listen to the radio porque están los chistes, you know, like, uh huh, uh huh. And, and then, yeah, and then that day she told me to pick up the kid. And, and so, you know, I was like working and then my wife calls me. She said, why haven't you picked up your son? And I said, what? I was supposed to pick up my son? Yes. Oh, my God. So I immediately went. 
All right. Who can give me an example with I was supposed to? Uh, for a simple meet today? Mm -hmm. I was supposed to uh, to give uh, yeah to give them a little medicine to my son. Mm -hmm. And I forgot. But you told your oh. wife that you gave him the medicine, right? <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> no, I had, I had to tell her the, the truth. Uh, she's next to you, huh? No, no. She's listening. He, oh. he, he just, no, I'm sorry. She she just asked me like an hour ago. Uh -huh. Do you give do you give him a message to 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 Alexito? Oh uh, uh, no, I forget. Don't do that, man. You have to lie. <laughs> Just say yes. And oh. tomorrow give him a double dose. <laughs> That's it. Right. Just don't complicate yourself. All right, Oscar, give me an example what okay, I was supposed I was, to. Okay, I was supposed to study for the test. Maybe. <laughs> but but you started getting you started drinking and drinking with your friends. Mm -hmm. Yes, I forget. But it's okay. Remember those days? Hey, no, let's study. And then let's just have one beer. And then after one beer, and then you just kept on drinking. And, <laughs> and then you're drunk. And then the next day, oh, my God, we were supposed to study. We can't study anymore. <laughs> Instead, give me an example. Um, I was supposed to rain today. You were supposed to what? I'm sorry. I was supposed to rain today. To flay. No, rain. Rain. Oh, okay. Sorry. That's a good example. But you can't say I. You have to say it. <laughs> okay, it. It was supposed to rain today. To it. I'm sorry. No, it was supposed to rain today. It was supposed to rain today. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, do you do you still read the newspaper? Class? No. no. Nobody reads. What is a newspaper? I don't know. Nobody reads the newspaper. Never mind. <laughs> Remember the weather in the newspaper? I remember one time I read, Clima para hoy, asoleado en el día, fresco en la noche. But like, that's it. It's like, wow, really? <laughs> Daylight in the, in the day and dark at night. Yeah. But my favorite was Moises Urbina. He would say, like, tomorrow it's going to rain. Uh, 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 this weather, the cold front is going to come in. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, come on, leave me alone. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I don't watch the news anymore. I, I don't watch news anymore since uh, 10 days ago or more. I yeah, I stopped watching the news. Kalena, <laughs> hi. Hi, Peter. Hi, everyone. Everybody. Kalena, Kalena, tell me, let's go, let's change from supposed to tell me something you have to do. Okay. Remember, remember when you lived with your parents? Mm -hmm. Remember when you went out with your friends on Saturday night? Yes. What time did you have to be back home? Two. Two a.m. Two in the morning. Yes. <laughs> it was my time <laughs> to get back. Wow, you had cool parents. But so you, you, wait, wait, your mother and father say, okay, Kalina. Be back by two in the morning. If you don't come back at two in the morning, don't come back. No, no, no. I had to <laughs> come back at two. At two. That oh, was okay. my last uh, 
Esa era mi última hora para regresar, pero para salir, ¿verdad? Yeah. And did they wait for you? Uh, yes, my mom. Always. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. I remember I had a but girlfriend. I was 23, 24 years. Yeah. Oh, okay. At the, at the university. Hey, but that was very cool. I mean, two in the morning. I had a girlfriend and her father would tell me she has to be back by 11. It's really my 11. <laughs> 11 to go to a discotheque? No. All right, let me see. Let me see. Jenny, can you tell me something you had to do when you lived with your, well, yeah, you lived with a lot of brothers and sisters. What, what, what is something you had to do in your house? I never lived with my brothers and sister. <laughs> you never lived with them? With um, well, with um, my old sister, just one. So, uh, so your siblings they live separately. Uh, yes, because uh, they live in United States. Oh, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. So, do you, so when you lived when you lived home with your parents, what is something you had to do? I have to do. I have to. I have to. No, I have to. I'm sorry. I have to is present. Past is I have, I have. to. Sí, sí. Lo siento. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. okay. I have to clean my bedroom and wash the bathroom. Okay. All right, watch the bathroom. All right, cool. Do we understand? Yes, teacher. All right, yes. and now we have, I, well, I had to, as I, well, the negative is I didn't have to. And then now we have, I needed to. Who is in their 40s? Elena, do you remember ¿cómo se llama? Román? Yes, I do. <laughs> What is, which discotheque did you meet him? Mario's. <clears throat> so to go into Mario's, what did you need it to do? Just look nice. <laughs> Yeah, that's true. Just look nice and and Roman will let you in. And you have, uh, no, I think uh, you have to have or not to say mm -hmm. a good attitude and look nice. Yes. Mm -hmm. So many kids from today's generation, they will never have been accepted in Mario's. I think so. Yeah. Yeah, before Mario's, it was like this picky high class, no, not high class, but like all the social, the society went there to Mario's. It's, it, it, was the disc, it was the place to be. Do you understand that expression? It was the place to be. Yes. Like if you yes. want to be cool, you have to go here. Hello. Okay, and to be and to go in, like Elena said, you needed to have a good presentation, or you needed to look good, or you needed to be with somebody who looked good. <laughs> It was very stupid. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yes, that doesn't exist now, but in that time it, it was. Where was it located? Where in La Zona located? Rosa. Uh -huh. In La Zona Rosa. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So I needed to. Mm -hmm. Do you remember Luis? Yes. Uh, yes, teacher. Luis, did you study in the university? Yes. 
I, I had the opportunity to study in the university. Where? Here in El Salvador, Universidad de El Salvador. Okay, good. And where did you live in that time? Uh, this moment I live here in San Salvador. No, uh, in, 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 in that time when you were in the university. In this moment. Okay, listen. Uh -huh. Where did you live in that time? Hey, what happened? Luis. <laughs> he disappeared. Okay, he will come back. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so he told me that he studied in the university in San Sal in El Salvador, right? El Salvador. Yeah, so uh, um, let me see. Nuri, did you study in the university? Yes, teacher. Okay, where did you study? Uh, uh, it's called uh, um, Christian University. Really? Where? Is um is I don't know where is the address. But, but it was in San Salvador. Salvador. Okay. Yeah. okay. San Miguelito. Okay. Yes. Yes. Near okay. San Miguelito. Yeah. Christian University of San Miguel. Something like that. Oh yeah. That was like by the circular, right? The, the, the one that, it was a big building? Yes. Yes. Okay, in that time, in that time, not now, in that time, where did you live? Oh, I lived um, in Apopa. In Apopa. And did you travel by bus or car? No, but by bus. Okay, how many buses did you need to take? Uh, ah, he's back. Sorry, teacher. It's okay. Uh, I need to take. Um, I needed. I needed. I needed to take two buses. Mm -hmm. Okay, to, to go to the university. Uh, to go to the university. All right, cool. All right, so class, do you understand? Everything was in past, right? Yeah. Yes. What is yep. what is something you really, really regret now? Please don't tell me something very dramatic. Or just tell me something like simple. Right. Like for for example, I regret not buying bitcoins ten years ago. <laughs> <laughs> they were fifty dollars, I think. One bitcoin was fifty dollars. <laughs> Ten days ago, nobody knows about it. Yeah. I remember the first time uh, there was a taxi driver and he invested in Bitcoins. And, yeah. And I said, this guy's crazy. Man. He told me, no, they cost $50. So, you know, I change, exchange. Uh, I think that person is rich now. Huh? I should yeah. have bought Bitcoins. Yeah. Okay. What about you? What is something you regret? Anybody? I do. Yes. I regret uh, don't finish uh, uh, the university. Okay, I I regret not finishing the university. Uh huh. Not finishing the university at that time. Okay, so then I should have finished the university. Repeat. I should have. I should have finished. finished. The university. The university. All right. Very good. Thank you. Anybody okay. else? What is something you regret? I should have uh, learned uh, English um, when I was a child. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Good. Anybody else? No, for me, it's the two same cases, like, the, like them. 
Oh, okay. Mirna, do you know that... Do you know that before... Um, you ex- have you. Yeah. Mary, are you Life. flying? <laughs> I feel the same. Huh? I feel in a you speak in a plane. And you say, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mirna, excuse me I for the question. Myself. Okay. Uh, do you have a boyfriend? No. Okay, but imagine if it, I don't know if you have a boyfriend, are your parents okay with it? Mm. And the moment I think that not. Okay. Because the reason why I ask you this, Mirna, is because, and the reason class why I ask Mirna is because she's 18. And I want to tell you that when I was 18, <laughs> or when I, you know, when I had a girlfriend, we needed, we men, <laughs> we needed to ask permission to the yeah. mother and father. You know, and that was, that was very difficult. Because we were like, oh but, my God. <laughs> but I don't know. I think that uh, fathers uh, were more like, I como comprendibles. I don't know if, if they uh, were happy for the for to the the daughter has had boyfriend i don't know no you see what 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 happens is because in my time when we went to ask for permission man we went well dressed you know like very clean cut you know and now they just go you know like hi hmm. you know with their hat like this eh, con las cejitas you know like uh, so I, I, I imagine the father, <laughs> yes, or like all tattooed, <laughs> you know, and that's something normal today. But in, in that time, it was not normal to be tattooed. And the piercings. Uh-huh. Um, bad Bunny style. Bad Bunny. Yeah. Yeah, Bad Bunny and Cristiano Ronaldo arruinaron la, la juventud de hoy en día. Yeah. <clears throat> so... What I'm telling you is that back in my time, we needed to ask permission. And I don't think, I don't think that tradition is, is still happening today. Today is like, hey, pop, mira, that's my boyfriend. Yeah. They uh, only the father. The yeah. boyfriend, the father. We had to call the house, like, <laughs> from a public phone. And you say, please, can I say, Papa, please don't answer the father. Please don't father. Please. And then you hear the voice, hello. Mm-hmm. Like, hey. oh my God, it was the dad. And now it's just like, what's up? <laughs> yeah. What about you, class? Do you remember anything in your past? Like like the example I gave to Mirna? Can you, can you give Mirna an example? Because I think Mirna is the youngest in the class. Teacher, yes. once my, my father say not. He didn't accept your boyfriend? No. In front of your boyfriend, he said no? Yeah, I was crying. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but I imagine you continued with him. Uh, no. Oh. Oh. No, my father is so, oh, obligate. Oh, obligated me. Uh, obligated me to cut him. And you did. Yes. Oh man. You you know what happens to my ex girlfriend when we were young. You know yes. she she got punished in front in front of me. Because of you. Yeah, but but we just were talking about. I know the father probably father and mother they were a little strict with her, you know, because because the I think the little her her, her little girl probably. And yeah. but we just were talking, you know, and she got 
she got a uh, furniture with an umbrella. We was he hit talking. Her. Yeah, yeah. We was talking just at the corner, you know, in the 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 hood, uh, the neighborhood. Oh, the neighborhood. Yeah, the neighborhood. Oh corner. man. Yeah, and she, and they found out. <laughs> yeah. De soltala, Erika, de soltala. <laughs> no, but we, we just were talking and she got put with the umbrellas. Yeah, the, umbrella. I mean, the woman, <laughs> it was, I, I don't think it was, it was very bad to be a girl in that time. Yeah. Because, I don't know, the, it was always the girl in trouble, the men, no. All right, Kalena, can you tell something to Mirna? Say, in my time, we needed to do this in school. We needed to. Something that you, something that when, when you are Mirna's age that you girls had to do that now you see that they don't anymore. I really don't know that. The for new... example, for example, I, I think I, I've seen like girls, they can go with blue hair or, or painted hair. No. Well, they can't? Never, no. At school. Now they can't. No, I don't know. I don't know if I, if I no. no. I, I well in my uh, in the bachillerato, I I, I I I yeah sorry in high school I can I could couldn't the uh, my the, ah paint my mm -hmm. nails paint my nails oh, or okay using acrylic nails. Yeah, or, or the hair, yeah. Oh, okay, oh, okay. But it's just in the high school and the school. Okay, okay. in my time, you can, you cannot. You couldn't. You couldn't, you couldn't paint your nails and uh, no makeup at all, nothing. No, ni rimmel, rimmel. <laughs> uh, I don't even oh, know what Rima so is. I, 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 I study uh, in a um, Catholic school and the, nun, the nuns was really strict. Uh, oh, see. I'm, I'm always has a, a, a key ojera. <laughs> How you say ojera? I bags. I bags. So they, they think that I am uh, use makeup. Oh, really? And always told me, go wash your face. Go wash your face because you are you have makeup. You know, I don't have nothing. And <laughs> it, oh, man. It was Do yeah, you don't know what what is female. What is what? Rimmel. Rimmel in English. <laughs> what is oh, it? it's the mask, the mask of your mask. Uh -huh. eye, uh, pestañas. Mm -hmm. Eyelashes. Eyelashes, yeah. But rimmel is mask. Mascara, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mascara. Mm -hmm. I remember eyeliner mm -hmm. because I used to put eyeliner. You, but only eyeliner. on my, only on one eyeliner. eye. Really? Um, I had I had on a facet of the cure and the patch mode. Do you know the patch mode? Right. Yeah. The, the yeah. cure. Band. Yeah, doing me faces. <laughs> so I West. used to be all black and put paint black. La, 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 those wow. guys, la, like those guys, uh, moderato guys. You remember the group? Yeah, moderato. The, uh -huh. the guy. Yeah, they used he, to do that. Yeah. Uh -huh. Paint. Mirna, guy. Yeah, Mirna. Do you know that before many many years ago, you could smoke in Pollo Campero or or Mr. Donut? Really. Yeah, and, and they also, even they the even cinema. had yeah the at, at the movies too. Yes. Yeah. yeah, I hate the the smell. No, yeah, but you know, in fact, 
I remember Mr. Donuts. They remember they had an ashtray. Oh. <laughs> Ceniceros. So fun. Yeah, they Mr. Pollo Camperos. They had ashtrays on their table. You could smoke, and on airplanes too. But I think that the the adults, they yeah, it is very common. We're very common. I mean, my bisabuela. I don't know how to say that. Great grandmother. Great grandmother. They she smokes. Smoke. Is is smoke? Mm -hmm. Smoking. I don't know. This, what, is she still alive? No. She smoked. She smoked for thirty years. <laughs> yeah. No, it's true. I, I used to smoke. I used to smoke a lot. And that's why I remember before when I was like 20, you could smoke anywhere. So all those places are allowed to you smoked mm -hmm. the, before. Yes. And nowhere, no, um, it wasn't a, a specific place for them. Yes. No, no you could smoke you, in, you a, smoke in a restaurant, every... in a public restaurant, anywhere. Oh, okay. <laughs> And now you can't, which is good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I remember that what Kalena said in, in the movies too. Movies? <gasps> yeah, you were beating your hot dog and smoking. But was the open room? No, it oh. was inside in the, yeah. in the rooms like today. Oh and God. every everyone's smoked. Everyone smoked. Yes. Too bad. Smoke. But yes, I know. Now it now it sounds crazy. <laughs> But before it was normal, like people didn't listen to this. Before, do you know los procedes, the, the gas stations? Mm. Yeah, the, the, Gabriela you? Mistral, the gas stations? Yeah. <laughs> to, to, mm -hmm. Now it's, it's the uno. Yeah. Before, yeah. like 20 years ago, maybe, or more. <laughs> You could drink there. That was, everybody went to the parking and people bought beer there and drank beer drink. and smoke. <laughs> Inside the, the gasolina. No, in the parking lot. Um. <laughs> you, could, you could do it uh, in every gas station. Drink? Yes. Yes. No, no, because if you can, um, the security will come and they tell you, please, you can't. Yes. No, not, not uh, today, not today, but a few day, a few yeah. years ago. You, yes, you could oh yeah, it. in any gas station, you could do it. Yeah. But I remember those two because I used to go there and man, Saturday nights, it was full. Like the, yeah. it was crowded, full. Very crowded. And mariachis, you know, they used to go yeah. there and people would buy beer. And, but it, can you imagine now? I, I talk with my friends, imaginate, man, we used to be there, and everybody smoking, smoking. in a gas station. <laughs> the gas pump. Like 100 people smoking in a gas station. Yeah, they were crazy. It's dangerous. Of course, yes. So <laughs> that's that's in the past. So before you could, like Larry said, you could you could drink in any in any in any any gas station, drink and smoke yeah. or whatever. Is there anything else that you remember? Things that we could do before and now we can't? Yes, when you go to, to Pueblo Campero uh, at the rush hour or maybe Sundays, you have to, to go to the tables and do something like uh, psychological pressure over the other person who are eating, who were eating. Oh, like looking at them. Really? Yeah. <laughs> that, that looks bad, right? Yeah, because Gosh. it was always so full. <laughs> so you just start looking at people like, are you finished? Are you finished? Are you, are you finished? finished? <laughs> staring at them. <laughs> yeah. So you could go inside and... and it's... Like, like are you waiting for, for the table? Yeah. I remember and... when uh, Little Caesars came. 
man, it was like La Elite, like Little Caesar was, wow. When they came. And now it's cheap pizza. Cheap. Like yes. the Domino's. Like Domino's. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's true. All right, so that, that's how that's how you can practice. That's how a good way to practice past modals. Like um, Alex didn't know that that before you could smoke in a, in the in the movies. Yeah. I, I I remember I used to frequently go to Cine Variedades. I don't know if it still exists. It's in El Toro Gos, in front of Cristóbal Colón. I don't think so. The Vietes. No, it's is the the Vietes. The hmm. Electrolab. Oh, yes. Yeah. But I used to frequently go there and we, uh, like you see this big smoke in the whole room. Oh it's, like, it's like all crowded. It was. Hmm. And um, listen to this. This was very cool. My favorite place when I was 20, I used to like to go. It was like San Luis. There was a bar there, La Ventana, Tres Diablos, and many, many foreigners, extranjeros or backpackers used to go there. So it was very, very cool. It would be insano, man. You know, people outside, you can go from one bar to another, and um, you meet a lot of people from other countries. Now, I hear that it's controlled by Maras. Really? Yeah. So uh, it, was, it was back then. <clears throat> Do you remember that in, before we had a Popeye chicken? Yes. We had a Popeye chicken in El Salvador. You could go there. Yeah. All right, class, uh, thank you very much. Have a very, very nice weekend, okay? Thank you. Thank Enjoy. You. Thank you. I hope you practiced the reading I told you yesterday. Thank you. Bye. Bye. All right. See you next week. Bye-bye. See you next week. See you Monday. Bye. 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 Bye-bye.